The New South Wales Government has released a white paper and draft legislation for a new planning system for New South Wales. The white paper is a simple explanation of changes that will be made to the New South Wales planning system and the draft legislation is also available for viewing. You can comment on these documents until the 28th of June 2013. I'm Emily Ryan, I'm the Outreach Solicitor at EDO New South Wales. The community can get information about the planning reforms by visiting our website, edonewsouthwales.org.au. We have a lot of information on the website, including a briefing paper which uh, discusses the changes being made in the white paper. Um, we're holding a series of workshops and seminars throughout New South Wales. Um, and we will also have uh, a link to our submission once that's ready on the white paper. The planning system uh, governs a lot of things throughout the state. People might think of planning as something that's a bit abstract and doesn't affect them. But planning is everything. Planning can be anything from um, a housing development next door to a mining or a CSG development. So it's really important for people to get in now and have a say about what they want the planning system to look like. They can talk about things like what kind of developments the community should be able to have a say about, whether areas of land should be set aside for certain types of developments or areas of land should be set aside so that other types of developments can't um, be built there. And just on the community participation, people should have a say on when they're able to have a say in the planning system. A lot of people come to us and they don't realise that they've got a planning issue. Um, we've got community groups, individuals, um, church groups, residence groups, all sorts of groups. These planning reforms are making really big changes to the way that the community will be able to participate in planning decisions. At the moment, a lot of community participation happens at the development assessment stage. What this new white paper is um, proposing is that most of the community participation will happen up front and at the strategic planning stage. So if you don't have a chance at the beginning, you might not have a chance to have your say at all. EDO New South Wales has a lot of resources about planning and environmental law. We have a fact sheet on how to write an effective submission, which will help people in making their submission on the white paper. We have um, a series of books about planning and environmental law, including information for rural landholders and for people concerned about mining developments, as well as a book um, on environmental law for Aboriginal communities in New South Wales. The message is to get engaged. It's really important for people to have their say. Um, the government is asking for people to have their say until the 28th of June, so you should write a submission.